Alrighty, so today I'm going to be drawing a geometric character, which I will admit I am quite excited to do. Now, I have drawn a geometric character previously. However, the idea I have for this specific drawing is not one that I have delved too deeply into before. And so as such, I certainly am quite excited to draw what I'm going to draw in today's video, as long as it turns out like I have in my head, at least, like as long as it turns out like the vision I have in my head at least. Today, I'm going to be drawing in my Soho Urban Artist sketchbook, and I'm going to be drawing with my Bic Round Stick ballpoint pen. But without further ado, let's go ahead and get my sketchbook all opened up, and let's go ahead and flip to the nearest open page, and, uh, well, get to drawing. So now that I'm on the nearest open page, let's just go and make sure this is all centered. It's cold in my room, and my nose is, is uh, dripping. Just make sure I get all that off and everything like that kind of thing. And now, without further ado, let's go ahead and get the cap off of my pen. And let's go ahead and first off, draw the head of this character. And I think I want the head of this character to be a triangle, like Phineas from Phineas and Ferb. That's kind of what I'm thinking. So I'm thinking triangle head. So let's do something like that. Bring it down. Bring it down. Just like that kind of thing to a point just like that. There we go. And then I'm going to have shoulders come out just like that. And then that's going to be brought down just like that kind of thing. I messed that up a little bit. Do I want to try to recover it? I think I can recover it. Yeah, I'm not really super happy with this specific one, but I've gotten the vision mostly out there. I just need to make some tweaks. Uh, I'm happy with the head. I want the nose to be the other way, though. I want the eyes to be a little bit more that way. Um, I'm pretty happy with the body. I did the shirt too long, though. Uh, it's too sh it's too long, so I kind of want to put the character more toward the top as well. I did the feet wrong as well. I did um, three toes, whereas I normally just do one toe. Oh, my phone just said it's a... Uh, on 20%, that's okay though, it's perfectly fine. But I've definitely got some things I need to work on, so let's go ahead and try, try that again. I put my, my pen completely wrong. So let's go ahead and try that again. Just kind of working my way through this idea. So let's go and do this a little bit more towards the top now. And I will admit some of the inspiration for this uh, drawing, I saw, I'd have to say like Phineas and Ferb, and then I saw um, some of, uh, I, I watched the, uh, what what is it, the the Amazing Digital Circus uh, sometime recently, and I, I just looked at the um, directors, the, the directors uh, of, uh, the creator and director of that uh, little um, pilot episode, um, they, uh, some of their art, and I, I like the style of their, some of their characters, I will admit, um, and the main character they draw has a very geometric look to it, and I decided, ah, I can do that too, and so that's exactly what I'm doing in today's video. go.
I drew the mouth a little bit lower than I wanted to. I kind of wanted to be a little bit higher up, but it's not really a big deal at all. And there we go. And yeah, overall, I'm I'm pretty satisfied with how this is turning out so far. I like this a decent amount. There are some other things, some other little details that I want to add, like just some... Oh, I messed that up a little bit. That's okay, though. It is what it is. Just some stuff like that. There we go. Just like that kind of thing. Just add some little other details in there. And now I'm thinking I want to go over this entire drawing again and just add another layer to the sketch just to make the drawing just look a little bit bolder. But so far, I am very satisfied with this drawing. So let's go ahead and first off, just uh, go over all of the lines again. Uh, with a lot of the characters I, I draw, I'd normally try to add like some sort of like patterns to the uh, clothing or something like that kind of thing, try to make it look a little bit more realistic. But I'm not, I don't think I'm going to do that today. I'm pretty satisfied with how this is looking as a whole, and I don't feel the need to do that one bit. So I'm not going to. As if my gut isn't saying I should. Well, I probably shouldn't, or should I? I, I? I try to, I try to, I, I try to trust my gut a little bit. I will admit, but anytime my gut is like, oh, you should, you should do this kind of thing, or I feel like I should do something, and it's kind of like that gut feeling, kind of like, okay, why am I feeling that way? Is that really necessary for me to do? Do I really need to do that? Got to analyze them gut feelings, not just trust it bi blindly, blindly, blindly. And I definitely have to say this is definitely looking much more distinct now, and I'm, I'm very happy with how this is looking now. There we go. Alrighty, let's just keep going just down like that kind of thing. There we go. We're just going to keep going all the way down, just like that. There we go. Alrighty. And I'm just going to go ahead and start just uh, going over some of the other little details again, like right here. Just darken that up a little bit. Just darken that up a little bit. Go ahead and hit these lines as well, I do think. Just like that. There we go. Just like that, and let's go ahead and go over the legs now. And the feet are the feet are pretty well sized right now. I'm thinking, so I don't think I'm, I don't think I'm gonna make them any bigger. I might make this one a little bit bigger, not terribly much though, just a little bit bigger. And I do kind of want to make them a little bit taller, but that's about it. Make the legs a little bit thicker as well. Of course, this character's wearing some Joe merch. Got to do it to him, you know what I'm saying? Just add some other little details and whatnot. And just thicken up some more lines. It's just a little bit kind of thing. There's definitely some lines that still need a little bit of thickening up, I feel like. Just need, need one more pass through.
And there we go. I think that's pretty much all done. I'm just going to thicken this up just a little bit. Just a little bit. And there we go. There is the geometric character that I drew in today's video. What am I thinking about this character? Do I like it? Do I not? I am overall much more satisfied with this character than not. And I am pretty happy with it. I really like how this character looks. And uh, I certainly hope you guys do as well. Let me know in the comments down below. What do you guys think of this character? Do I have any constructive criticism for myself? Not really. This turned out to be pretty much exactly how I wanted it to turn out in my head. <clears throat> Excuse me. Excuse me. I can't complain one bit. I really don't have any constructive criticism for myself at the moment, but I'm sure as I look at this uh, more and more in the future, especially after I've taken probably a couple days from, from looking at this and then I look at it again, I'm sure I'll have some constructive criticism for myself, but at the moment I really don't have much. I'm just pretty satisfied uh, with how this turned out, that is for sure. Let me know in the comments down below what you guys think of this drawing. And of course, please make sure to all like and subscribe for more content. I have my uh, Instagram, my book, my merch, my P.O. box, and my uh, main channel all in the description down below. Go check it all out. But uh, yeah, thank you so much for watching, y'all. Till the next one, stay safe and peace and have a great one. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. You know what I'm saying?